Okay guys, here is uh, the uh, other part of the video that I came out to create, the uh, light bulb, okay? So now this is what I have so far. Um, I created just a couple of them and I'm gonna show you how to create one, okay? Notice that my lines are perfectly tangent to each other. All right, so um, you can, you can, if you have a better approach to my design, by all means, go ahead and take it on. You don't have to follow every step of the way, uh, but this is, this is that, that's how I like to work, okay? So uh, I uh, the first thing I do is I make sure that I get a lock down on my snap, and uh, I'm gonna um, just start my circle from here to here, then another line from the center. I'm gonna turn off my snap now and say center of the circle and coming down, and then exit, and then I'm gonna use the offset command. The offset command is I'm actually gonna set up to 0.75. Now why 0.75? Well, simple because 0.75 it's the closest <laughs> that I that I liked on this uh, on this design I could use something bigger like I could use if um, if you don't see the lines offsetting that means that your limits are 300 by 300 okay uh, offsetting it one unit to the naked eye when you're working on a 100 by 100 sheet doesn't really you know doesn't do anything you won't you won't see the difference in it, okay so then after doing that offsetting business there, I like to do my fillet command and I want to tell it fillet, but give me a radius of three units. So when I have that, I can touch the circle and then the line. Enter, again, R for radius. Enter the circle and then the line. Then escape and then say trim and trim that and that. Okay, notice that my design looks very clean. It looks very, um, you know, there is not the all tangible edges are set up okay. There is n n not much of a problem. So the next thing I like to do is I'm gonna create my lines uh, and I'm gonna create a line from there to there. Okay, and um, I'm gonna. Um, well, first of all, I'm gonna actually I'm gonna create a line from here to here, okay, to close this element, and then I'm gonna say copy that amount, that, uh, and uh, the displacement is gonna be there, okay. Um, I'm gonna say I'm gonna try to use uh, M for multiple, so uh, there we go. Uh, okay, it didn't quite work like that. Okay, so um, again, copy, and that's my element. I'm gonna copy, and my second point of displacement is going to be near, and then again near, and then again <laughs> near. I I um, I forgot to set up something and. That is why it's not doing now, but I created four of them. So all I have to do is uh, actually copy the four that I created. So copy and then displace them from here up a distance uh, of maybe that much. Well, it's not copying it right now because it doesn't know where to copy. Okay, so we need to tell it. We need to tell it where to copy. And in this case, I'm gonna say near a object. So that's why it's like doing that little crappy stuff. So then I get near. And you notice that little symbol in there coming up on the line so that would indicate near that actually indicates near so um, I'm gonna come down here and then make the line make the line and then just kind of like play around a little bit kind of like beefing it up so then that's it I'm all, that it's over that, that's all I had to do all right and then maybe come back here and of course you know do a little freestyle stuff and I don't know it's totally up to you um, but then that's done that's it all right, very simple. All right, um, so that's that. That was all, right? It wasn't that hard, not that painful. Uh, let me see how how we're we doing on time. Okay, it looks like we're half a we're Okay, so that that's all we have to do for that one. Then the the other part of the assignment is create a line from here to here to here, and then call up the uh, circle command. Draw a circle, tangent, tangent, and tangent. So tan, tangent, tangent, and tangent. And here you have it. 
okay very simple the other part of the assignment was to create a circle with two points so here's my circle and I'm gonna say draw circle um, I think it was the two points okay so I'm gonna start my print at the quad um, that and then tangent okay so there 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 is the circle okay a little weird but but that that that's acceptable right <laughs> um, so then the other one was to use the circle the tangent uh, and then uh, well that actually didn't quite work well but you, you'll actually get the idea on that one, right? I mean, it's just drawing a couple of circles and telling it where to, where to begin. So I have two point, two point circle or tangent, tangent, radius. So I can say tangent, tangent, and then the radius of maybe that much. And there I have it. So then again, I repeat that command and say T for tangent and tangent, tangent, and then tangent that well but you get the idea I hope you do <laughs> it's not really all that great difficult it's actually pretty easy to do okay very easy stuff uh, anyways this is that is that was all the assignment just making sure that you have your tangencies the light bulb is the most cr crucial and critical the the other light uh, the the little circles in here I don't think they're all that all that great crucial okay anyway guys so this is this is all I have uh, and I hope uh, that that helps I uh, I will be stepping down from the grading. I think the other TA likes to do some some grading too. So I'm gonna um, I wanna let, take on in the following grading for assignments three. I'll talk to him tomorrow. I'm sure that you know you guys are gonna do great. There shouldn't be a reason. I said why not too. But in any case, you have a problem, you have anything, let me know. And uh, I do appreciate those contacting me already for the class, for the uh, private tutoring session. I'll get with you as soon as possible. And uh, if you're interested, again, let me know, okay? All right, guys, I got to go. I'll see you all later. Uh, take care, stay positive, and think positive, and you'll see the outcome. All right, bye-bye, guys.